Hello, uh, in this demo I would like to show you uh, the two enhancements that we've made to uh, secure the fall endpoints uh, in this release and that is uh, the fact that secure endpoints now work in single host mode and the second maybe more important one is that we uh, fixed secure endpoints such that the paths defined on them are honored and supported. So uh, in my demo I'm, I'm going to use a server deployed in single host mode just to show you. Here is my uh, custom resource using which I deployed the server. And it's configured to run in single host mode. So here's my uh, Eclipse dashboard. I'm showing a workspace that is just adapted our Quarkus quick start and uh, it has an endpoint which has a path and also I've modified it to be secure and authenticated using JWT cookies of the of chess server provided by chess server. So when I start this workspace And I start the server that uh, I defined my endpoint for. And I click the link uh, to access my server. You may have noticed a couple of things. First, uh, even though the server, chess server, is running in single host mode, the user application is deployed on a subdomain. That's uh, something that we've added in the last release and now you can see it running uh, on a server in a single host mode. Second is that the endpoint has been defined with a path and that path is now honored and correctly shown in the preview. And the third thing you may have noticed is that we, before uh, the application was accessed, uh, there was a brief uh, page showing the fact that we were loading a runtime token, meaning that uh, the JWT authentication has taken place and uh, this server is only uh, accessible using uh, chess server authentication. So that's it for the demo. Thank you.